hello good morning all today in this video we are going to discuss regarding the rec name in Odoo so currently in the screen you are seeing Odoo version 14 community edition where we are continuing our Odoo 14 development tutorials so if I go to the hospital menu here you can see we have added a new model called doctors and its view so if I open you can see you have a content view tree view and form view so that I have defined I haven't shown this in any video because we already know how to create models and the related views so you can just try adding a new model that is you can add a new menu and then its related views so what we will be talking about is the red name in Odoo so first of all I will start with the usage or where we have to use that so if I go to the appointments so if I open the appointments and if you try to create a new appointment you can see there is a new field added that is doctor so in the appointment model I have defined so if you go to the pie charm and this is my custom add-ons path and this is my module so if you go to the models folder and then to the appointment.py here you can see I have added a new field that is doctor ID which is of type many to one with comodal as hospital dot doctor and I have added same in the corresponding view that is appointment view dot XML so here you can see I have added a new many to one field in the appointment model with comodal as hospital dot doctor as we have added the patient ID so if I come back to the browser you can see this is the patient field and this is the doctor minute one field so if you check the patient field you can see the name of the patient like Sam Tom James Anthony etc but if you click on the doctor what you are seeing you are seeing hospital dot doctor comma two and what if you add a new doctor uh, what if I add a new doctor called uh, James so I'm adding a new doctor called James of age 50 I'll keep the mail, gender as mail itself so I have added one more record and if I come back to the appointments and if you try to create new record why we are not seeing the name instead we are seeing the model name comma the ID so here comes the usage of the red name in Odoo so if I come back to the pie charm and first let's compare the difference between the doctor and the patient model so the case is that inside the patient model we have a field called name but I haven't added a field called name inside the doctor model instead of giving name I have given as doctor name in order to show the use case of rec name so once you have a field called name inside your model so for the patient model you have a field called field with technical name as name then once we add many to one to this model the value inside the name field will be shown so if I come to here and once we choose the patient this is the many to one field to the hospital dot patient so we, here we have a field called name field with technical name as name so the value inside that field will be shown but we don't have a name field in, inside the hospital dot doctor model that's why we have we can we are getting like this so in order to show, solve this either we have to define a name get function so to to the that functions that is we either we can give a rec name or we can define a name get function so I'll come to the name get function in the later part of this tutorial series right now we will be focusing about a rec name so in order to solve this so I need to see here the doctor's name so what you have to do you have to set a rec name for the model so if I go to PyCharm and this is the doctor model so along with here I will add one attribute called a rec name equal to doctor name rec name equal to doctor name so if you search this rec name inside the Odoo source code so find in path and if you search this inside the Odoo source code you can see its use case it has been used in lot of position so once you don't have a name field in the model 
don't forget to specify the direct name so by default direct name will be the name field so once you don't have a name field inside the model you have to define a rec name so along with the model name you can see underscore rec underscore name equal to you have to specify which field you have to show not only in the many to one drop down so if I duplicate this tab if you go to the doctor's model so I'll go to the doctor's menu and if I open here you can see even here you will be seeing this one and if I go here you will be seeing hospital dot doctor 3 which is the model name and ID that is model name comma ID and if I come back here you can see the hospital dot doctor 2 whereas in the patient we are seeing the patient name here so we have defined the direct name as doctor name so let's upgrade and see whether there is the difference so I have restarted the service now I'll go to the UI and I'll be upgrading the Odo 14 development tutorials module so yet if you haven't got this module just go to the Odo app store and search for Odo development tutorials by Odo Mates. so the module has been upgraded successfully now if I come back to the hospital then to the appointments and if I try to create a new record and if I click on here you can see instead of what we have seen before right now we are getting the correct name Philip James etc and also here you can see here we what we have seen earlier was like this and now it has been changed to the correct name and if I refresh here you will see the difference you can see it has been coming correctly and if you go to the doctors and if you open you can see here also it has been got changed so this is the use of a rec name in Odoo simply you have to give like this so you cannot give only name field if you need to show the age suppose if I need to show the age instead of the doctor name I can give it like this but it will be tough for us to identify the doctor with the age so let's try this anyway so we will be going to the UI and I'll be upgrading the module once again so if you feel our videos are helpful don't forget to refer your cha this channel with your Odoo friends who is looking to learn Odoo development so if I go back to the hospital then to the appointment so right now what we will be seeing instead of name we will be seeing the age you can see 0 50 so you can see if you go to the doctor's model the age of Philip is 0 and age of James is 50 so if I change this age to uh, 25 and if I come back here you will be seeing 25 and 50 so this is the use of a rec name in Odoo simply you have to give a rec name equal to and if you search inside the Odoo source code rec name equal to you can see a lot of sample inside the Odoo source code itself you can see so that's all about this video and if you like the video please do click the like button and subscribe the channel so that you will not be get you will be getting notified regarding all the upcoming videos and oh, one more thing that I, I would like to add so you can see right now I have given the field name as a doctor name actually it is not recommended to give like this inside the doctor model you don't have to specify doctor name simply you need doc name itself so I have added it like this in order to show the working of the rec name so simply you have to this is the coding convention that you have to take you have to take care of while defining don't give a name like this actually this is a wrong method simply you have to give like name equal to because you know it is a doctor model itself then if we you have a name field it should be the name of the doctor don't need to specify doctor name so I'll keep as it is in this tutorial but when you code in the real case just use name so that's it for the day have a nice day thank you